Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Spider Man or Spider Car or Spider Pigeon thing, whatever we're, we're, we're um, calling the, the uh, thing in my pub. Now, you'll have to bear with me, I've just woke up. So, I forgot to get me a coffee. I just realised as soon as I started recording, I forgot to get me a coffee, so I'm a little bleh. I have, however, got a bottle of Pepsi Max up here, but the caffeine kick isn't really the same. So you'll have to bear with me why I try and half-heartedly function and remember how to talk and whatnot. Um, <clears throat> but <clears throat> and I've got something in my throat. Again. I always seem to have something that's stuck in my throat whenever I want to record. I don't know what it is. I just seem to be permanently full of cold nowadays. But as I said in the last episode, uh, we're going to carry on with some of this story and stuff now because I've done a couple of episodes of exploring the city. I don't know why I'm, I'm talking like this. I do apologise. I think I'm still tired. But, um... I think... I do a couple of episodes of story. And then a couple more episodes of... Just exploring everything. I think that way... We should be able to... Keep it like... Not unpredictable, but like... Oop. Or like mixed and matched and whatnot. And... Not too much of one thing. And not too much of the other. There we go, we're getting some attitude. So, how have you all been anyway? I hope you've all had a good, however, what has it been a week, two weeks? I forgot when the last time I recorded was. I should have checked. Uh, but I bet you've all had like a good two weeks or whatever. Um, I kind of have. I'm still happy, I don't know, I'm probably mentioned about my back countless times, haven't I, I think. I'm still having problems with it. Um, it seems now to affect in like both my arms So it's all just crazy Like I can't even sleep properly at the minute because if, if I lie on one side I, I lose feeling in my arm that arm that I'm lying on if I lie on my back my neck seems to just twist and contort to make to I think subconsciously make myself more comfortable for my back and it's just frustrating. It really is. I mean, well, I think one of the problems that isn't helping is I've got to try and buy a new mattress because I've had my mattress for, I think, uh, at least eight or nine years now, I think. So I think I read somewhere that you're only meant to have a mattress for like seven years, aren't you? You're meant to change it every seven or something. So, because I've got a spring mattress as well, that doesn't help. So I imagine that by now all the springs have worn out. We're on it, don't you worry. And I think um, as well, my mattress has shrunk a little. People might be hurt. Because it's meant to be a king size bed. Hey, that's not a vehicle collision. That's a freaking assault right there. Pew, pew, pew. What are they doing? Why? Why? You're meant to be saving the people, not freaking attacking them. Jesus Christ! A pedestrian is trapped under that car. I have to help them. I know Spider-Man, Spider-Man, but oh, it's a robbery as well at the same time, is it? Wow! Two for the price of one. Okay. Right. Uh, still trapped. Need to help fast. Yeah. Got it. Go, 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 buddy. Over here. Help, Give me one minute. Spiderman can only do one thing. Where are you? That's everyone. Glad I was here to help. Oh, okay, I thought there was two people. Someone died. Oh, dear. Hey, lady. Hey! Oh, come on! I'm trying to high-five that lady and the ambulance hit me. Jeebus. But yeah, so um, my bed's meant to be like a king size bed and I'm sure my mattress has shrunk because it doesn't seem to fit like the whole of the bed anymore. So I've been looking half-heartedly and I think I'm going to get like a, uh, a memory foam mattress or something. Hey guys. Hi Herman. Seriously? 
He looks like Iron Man. That's what you said last time. I think he is going to get away because I'm quite freaking terrible at getting Spider-Man in the minute, aren't I? Actually, I don't. He's trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. What well, I forgot to do it. Ah, there we go. Got him. Gotcha. Now let's talk. Noted. Okay. Right, so we're gonna try and catch Honestly, him again. Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. I look. Move, move, move. I look how like he's a kid, and yeah, he's going up against like growing adults and everything. He still manages to like beat most of them up and whatnot. Ah oh, no, I'm stuck. I'm gonna itch on my nose, but I can't. Got ya. You know what, Herman? You have like zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk about <laughs> my details? <laughs> Maybe later. Come again? What was he saying? <laughs> Good work, Spider Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> it looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here. And I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah. Whenever, whatever. <laughs> nah. Yeah, it looks we're talking again. Cool. Well done, Petey. Little Petey Parker. Right, let's go find out about the mask. Oop. Head die. Oh, right, yeah. Spider Man doesn't use doors, does Almost he? Morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee, Mr. Lee. A pay go. Did he eat his bed? Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Food, emergency, aid, shelter, training. This is what we could do within the UK for all the um... guys holding up all right. This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked, and she's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. You don't know that. Nobody. Well, I'm coffee. not going anywhere. That's a promise. 
looks really appealing. I'm daydreaming about coffees now. But yeah, this is what the UK needs, something like this. I mean, we've got loads of abandoned buildings. Surely, especially in Derby, we've got homeless everywhere. So surely we could do something like this just to help the guys. Surely. I mean, I'm... <laughs> I know there's um, loads of people that like to volunteer to help and whatnot. So surely this is something that, like, government should look into rather than, like, the whole Brexit fiasco. Look at solving, like, stuff that's closer to home. I mean, they've got the resources, the money and everything. Peter. I do for you. I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. She wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. <laughs> Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. It scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Ah. Uh, he knows something more about this mask that he's not letting on. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. <laughs> but yeah, like, the UK at the minute is... Like... Most con oh hello. He kept Uncle Ben's clothes a long time. It's like he was still looking out for her. Oh bless. Wish I could afford an electric wheelchair. Can make you one. But yeah, the UK's got so many problems at the minute, like with knife crime and homelessness and whatnot. And yet all they're bothered about is like this stupid Brexit deal. That's been going on for like four years or however long it's been now. Either leave or don't. Let's try and sort our country out. But yeah, I'm not going to make this all polit uh, poli po po political. Because I don't really care about Brexit or whatnot. I'm bored of it. So I just like giving my suggestions. Like speaking out my thinking out loud basically about what we could do to help. Like the homeless, the environment and all that jazz. Right. Where are we going next? Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Okay, so we've got so we're gonna make this an exploring episode as well. Wow, okay. New side mission or not, let's uh So what we got? My apartment so we got some stuff to explore here. Okay, has this radio tower been done? Yeah, it has hasn't hit there. Right, let's go get this one. But yeah, um, I'm trying at the minute to re reproduce, not reproduce, Rob, uh, reduce my plastic usage just to try and do my little bit to help whatever I can. And um, I'm reading this book at the minute that I saw recommended on Instagram. It's called 101 Ways to um, Go Zero Waste or something like that. It's really good. It's basically like a book of tip. Oh, crime. We've got crime. Hey guys! You guys don't look like locksmiths. 
But yeah, it's telling you about stuff you can do to reduce crime. It's giving you like loads of like. Sure, she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. <laughs> We're talking again. Baby step. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. He's got a good boss, man. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Oh, bless her. But yeah, um, it tells you like some really cool stuff like how to minimise you, your plastic usage. Uh, Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I, mean, I didn't forget, forget. I just, I, I'll be there soon. His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. Oh, dear. How did I lose track of time? We only done one little thing. Right, so where are we going? Where are we? Oh, over here. Okay, so I reckon I can go get this bag here. And then we'll get make our way to Otto Octavius. But, um, yeah. There's loads of stuff, like how you can use, rather than like buying all plastic stuff, there's so much alternative, like instead of using, uh, what is it, like so many cleaning products, there's actually stuff you can make at home that's really good cleaning, um, using household items, like uh, a lot of it is just like baking powder and white vinegar and by by cardium sodium or something or oh, whatever it's bait something like that i can never remember the name and like the stuff for like healthcare, like using i don't know if you have like oh, come on peter what i hate it when he does this no i just want that bag it's right <coughs> there why won't you just crawl up peter God damn it! Thank you. No! Oh my God! Can I get on that ladder? No, I can't. All right, where are you, back? Her? Oh my days! This is so freaking annoying. Right. No. I don't want you to do that. I just want to get this bag. <coughs> but yeah, there's like stuff you can... <coughs> Sorry guys, I've got it. It's back in my throat again, whatever it is. Uh, there we go. But yeah, there's um, stuff like if you if you have freshly ground coffee, you can use your coffee granules as like. No, I had it then. Use your coffee granules as. No, Peter. This is so frustrating. It's really it's like Assassin's Creed. No, no, it's just get the damn bag for. Good Lord. You know what? Sod the damn bag. I'm going to... I can't. My OCD won't let me forget it. Right. Why? Thank you. Harry's <sighs> VIP card for the nightclub. Harry always tried to include me. Right. Okay. Let's go this way. Yeah, if you make, I can carry on talking now. If you make like freshly ground coffee or whatever, um, if you have like a, a French press or a coffee machine or something, you can actually use the coffee 
rounds. It's like a, a, a face wash. If you mix it with, what is it? There's um, an oil, oh, I've missed the bag, oh, never mind. There's an oil you can mix it with and something else. And it's meant to be a really good like exfoliating face wash. Got the car back taken. Oh. Dodge, Peter. I told you to dodge. Boo. You whole square to use the air launcher. Right, never mind. Where are we going? No wonder I'm always late, because I don't bloody know where I'm going. Ah, there we go. Thank you. Oh, here we go. It's my number one fan. Myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, aka the Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti Spider Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sense of craft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package. J. Jonah Jameson refuses. <laughs> so he's to blame... He tried to build a, cy um, a cyber Spider-Man as a way to... <laughs> Interesting. Right. Anyway, enough chatter. We're here. Let's go. Ah, my headphones. Crap. Sir. Oh no, the badge. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... That's amazing. <laughs> What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Oh, God. Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <laughs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. In a secure environment. At Oscorp. 
You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. <clears throat> Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talk about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> oh, you slimy. Easy, easy, easy. They, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Oh man, that proper sucks. Stun back to save your gadgets which appear at the time. Dad, sure you see how long moved before again. Hey, remember to check my moves page for the ninja from the drama moves. Mess around from the website was defended to find this place. It's R2 the sprint part. Yes, we know R2, it's annoying. <laughs> really? Right. Man, that's quite depressing. It really is. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. We should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. Okay, that's uh there must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Whee! Let's go check out. Harry's research station, see whatever it was that he was researching. I love that double armed catapult, that's amazing. Whoops. Up we go. Right, here it is. Harry left me a message about these before he left the room. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's going to shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Uh -huh. Well, it's not going to pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. Right, open more research stations around the city to earn more research tokens. Press X to continue. Okay, um. So, what do they do? This is another FR air quality station. It's monitoring contamin uh, contaminants in the surrounding atmosphere. Super important for the city and its citizens. But certain corporate overlords are less than thrilled by the prospect of pollution, of their pollution output being publicly reported. Okay. So what we're doing is it a puzzle i've got a couple stations measuring air pollution the idea is to catch the own what's the word contaminants before they reach toxic levels between you and me i think oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting the amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons Jeez. in the air is way too high and rising if it keeps getting worse people could die particles are concentrating in trouble spots like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Okay, that's uh, what we've got. Right, before we do that, I've just seen a landmark and a backpack over here. So we'll, I'm going to try and kill like two birds, with, three birds with one stone, even, as they say. So if we. Love uh, I wasn't blocking the sidewalk. How dare you! Right, where's this backpack? I can hear it beeping. Ah, there it is up here. When the vulture cracked my eye lens, it almost blinded me. That was a wake up call. Had to upgrade to a stronger material. Huh. Right, okay, let's go collect this smog, or at least smog. Find out who's poisoning. Funny how um, 
this is a mission just after I've been talking about like zero waste and whatnot and how protect how to help the environment and everything. How do I collect it? Do I just Oh it's there. How do I they are? I gotta swing right through those clouds. Uh, whoa, that's a lot. Bloody hell. Didn't swing through that one, did I? No. For these clouds to be there visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. Ah, uh, it's falling with style. Ah, come on! Why can't I? Got it. Thank you. Oops. Crap. Crappity crap. Ah, no. Where are you gone, Peter? Right there, that you can surely let's wait. Why is it so freaking frustrating? No, maybe if I try swinging. No, I don't like the camera angle sometimes, it's annoying. Oop, where we going? All right, so it's there. So if I do that and swing. Oh come on! I'm getting some Thank good you. stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff anyway. <laughs> Got it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> uh, nope, missed that one. Ah, I've got ah. I've got a splinter or something in my thumb, I've just found it. Ah, I don't know where that's come from. <laughs> Suck it in, baby. Suck it in. Get all that carbon monoxide. Oh, yeah. That's how we do it. Right, so there's one. I missed it. Oh, come on! Right, okay, so if we go to the one by the crane, that might be easier to... I must be freaking these people out. Ah, what else is new? Right, okay, so that's that one. Right. Huh. Got it. The toxin's coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Where's... Oops, sorry. There's literally where where are you? I got it. I got a picture. It's literally right here. <coughs> Can I zoom in on it? Oh no, okay, maybe. Maybe it's good wait, let me do it because I'm on the mission. next one okay so we're going oh no this way ah whoa there thank you can you imagine if i was actually playing like a game called the floor is lava i'd suck i'd be dead a million times over at this rate come on spear man we can do it hey come here i just want to Ah, nah. 
let's go get the chimney stack. There we go. That's how you swing. Best smokestack picture I oh. ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Yes, mate. Earth Day. Well, right. The Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Right. I think oh, Shock is back. Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him. Then he what? Suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Right, guys. I'm going to end this episode here in a second. I'm just going to get as close as I can to that mission. Uh, and I'm going to upgrade my suit. And then end the episode. Way. We're nearly there. Peter, I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. The vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman, actually pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Right, okay. Right, that's uh, that's what we got. We got a suit, we got a new suit. Ooh, this one looks nice. Synchronizes nanomesh particles to unleash a devastating wave of negative energy. Ooh, okay. Uh, how do I know which ones I own? Oh, because it, it says equip or craft. Duh. Right, then we've got some new gadgets. Can I upgrade this? I can't. Wow. Add two shots to the max. Okay, so if we upgrade that one. And then increase. Okay, I can't do that one yet. Just yet. Uh, what about this one? So I can upgrade you. Okay. Uh, that's level 15. And then... My little spider bug, okay, mate. No. What's this one? Oh, pulse like waste and sends enemies flying. Damn it, I need challenge tokens, okay. And then, do I want to use my skill points? So, these times speed, fatal hits, cost two. How many points have I got? Three. Air strike, vengeance, web slinger. Hold on there, swing kick, and miss. Uh, hold triangle to grab and throw web electro identity dust to turn away or walls. Ah, look at that. There's the disarmor. That's what I want. Okay, so I'm going to start working my way through this one there. Web throw can now be used in news list. Increase perch date. Ah, god damn it. Right, so I'm going to go for that one. And then I'm going to go for that one because that would be even more useful. Right, okay. And then I think I'm gonna. I kind of like the idea of this suit. It looks quite nifty. So if I learn that, learn that, and then okay, so I need more. Re oh, hello. But I think I'm gonna start wearing this suit because it looks quite nifty, like really cremazine. And then, oh no, wrong way. No, I will get the hang of it eventually. Right, what's this suit? Power, negative shot waves, synchronizing nanomesh by just leaves with wave negative energy. Would that be wet better than the um the spider bro? Ooh. Maybe some of you back up when alerted. I think I'm gonna go for this one. Let's try see what that's like. And then what we've we got? Combat analyzer reduced incoming melee damage, increased range of AR scan show items and enemies further away. 
Right, I think that will do. So, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to go grab myself a coffee and whatnot. Um, so, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have all enjoyed it. And um, please do leave a like if you enjoyed the episode. And subscribe to this channel if you want to keep up to date with this series or any other series. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Well, that was a bit of a uh, voice break and screech. Well, I apologise. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Take care. Bye.